happened if she had hurt, if the horse had hurt her, he had freaked out and run into her, what would have happened then? Then you had to control your own horse. Right. Then you need to get your horse broke. My point being, you were walking. You don't want her in the ring. I was right there. You come and say, Lindsay, I don't feel comfortable with the situation. Please take her up. You don't pick up a child, especially not mine. What you do is you're only fine, like a stack of potatoes and carry her out without asking me. She's I watched you. Hours. I watched you I carry her out. I did it. All right. Look, forget it. I understand you did it. No, I understand you did it for her safety. My point being, you should have said. And I didn't do it in any unpleasant way. I was making a game out of it. I don't know why she was screaming for two hours. I'm just simply saying, you have no right, none at all, to put your hands on anyone's child in any way, shape, or form without discussing it with them first. You should have just come to me and said, she's three. I know she doesn't listen all the time. Lindsay, Skyler's not listening. I don't feel it's a safe situation. Please come and get her out of the ring. No problem. There were three adults standing right outside this door. Three of us. Right there. When you walked her out. When I brought her out, you were... No, I don't know. Really? Of, yeah. you want to, how much do you want to put money on that? Because I have surveillance Boy, cameras beautiful. and I can prove it to you. you were where right I was near the cross site. There was a horse there and you all were grouped that's around not, the horse. That's not three quarters of the way. The I door is right third. there. The door is right I there. Said a third you know what? You have 30 days. Get your horse, get your stuff, and you have 30 days to find a new place to go. All right.